you, you love me. We are happy family with a great big hug. How are you? It's your teacher Nonseta. Welcome to Easy Elimo Learning Simplified. Reading and writing time using the digital clock. You can see there are two clock faces on our on our board. We said the one on the right side is the analog one. And we are moving from analog going to digital. Okay? So if I'm told, represent quarter past two on the analog clock face. How will I be? My hour hand is two. And when you talk about quarter, we said this one is divided into four equal parts. So quarter past is on this side and two is on this side. So quarter will be on three and then two is where my, my hour hand is. So if I'm told now represent that time on the digital clock face, what am I supposed to do? I'm supposed to get my hour hand My hour hand is 2. Then the other one will be the other one will be quarter represents it's represented by quarter is represented by quarter is represented by 15. So my time will appear like that on the digital clock face. Quarter past two, quarter past two. I'm told now, represent your, your time is quarter to three. Two is on this side. We said this is two. This is two. And this is past. And this is half. And this is o'clock. So I've been told to represent quarter two. Quarter two, remaining five, 10, 15 minutes. So my hour hand will be on nine, quarter two, three. So it is just remaining some few minutes to three. That is how my clock face will look on the analog clock face. When I come to digital clock face, it now changes from two. No, 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 no. It's still okay. It will be two. But now the time will change from 15 to 45. Meaning the remaining how many minutes? 15 minutes to, to three. So it is quarter Two, quarter to three, it is how represented on the digital clock face. Now, I want someone to tell me this time on the, on the digital clock face, half past 11. Someone to represent that on the digital clock face. How do you represent that on the digital clock face? I will come like this we said half means 30 one hour is equals to 60 minutes so half will be represented by 30 very good johnny so i'll represent there 30 then we are talking about half past 11 and now i indicate the time for our hand which will be So it has passed 30 minutes after 11 o'clock. So this is how it will look like. Seeing that, so half past 11 on the analog digital shows, it is 11.30. What if the clock face shows Quarter to 12, quarter to 12. What will your, 
what will you um, quarter to 12 meaning that is how many 15 minutes to 12 and 15 minutes is represented by 45 like this then you say how many minutes that is quarter to 12 it's 11 45 showing that the remaining only 15 minutes to reach what it has not reached 12 but the remaining some 15 minutes 5 10 15 to reach that 12 and that is how you will represent yeah her now do you need to represent this this is uh -huh. the long hand is on and the short hand is there so what does it tell us what does it tell us the long hand is on 10 and the short hand is next to one it is telling us that the time they are remaining how many five ten ten minutes to one so what is it it's telling us that the time is 12 12 what if it is remaining uh -huh. 10 minutes it is 12 12 this 12 50 remaining remaining 5 minutes it is showing us that the time is 12 50 that is exactly what you're supposed to do when you're told to represent the time using the digital clock face any question any problem it was nice having you around and i just want to wish you all the best thank you